Wow, this baby handles like a dream. You guys mind if I drive with my knees while I make some last-minute fantasy football changes? <laughs> oh, man, Joe is gonna be so pissed! Thank God all we hit were those trash cans. Oh, my God! Oscar! Uh, tell my ex-wife... to go herself. Very on brand. Right up to the end. Brian, please, let's just have a nice family car ride like we always do. Except for the time Dad hit that deer. Yeah, it looks, looks like it's just a ding. Uh, you know, there's, there's no reason to get the insurance companies involved. Well, you know, I should still take down your information, though. Really? Because, would... you know, you, you could probably just buff that out. I yeah, mean, but I would really feel better if I got your information. You know, why is there a huge pile of food under the table by your chair? What? Oh, that's all the gross food you made. Don't worry, Brian will eat it. Brian's gone. Well, and this is a perfect chance to do something I've been wanting to do forever. Kids, family meeting. Now that there's no dog in the house, we can finally throw gross things in the open bathroom trash. I've got a bloody Kleenex from when I blew my nose too hard. Put it in there. How about bloody toilet paper from wiping too hard? Everything bloody from everything too hard goes in there. I'm not proud of this family. Principal Shepard, what's it gonna take to get Meg into a college? If Meg has any chance at all, she's going to need a little extra help. Oh, we'll do anything, whatever it takes. Now you do understand how this works. We understand. I guess I'll, uh, I'll meet you in the car. He didn't mean you have to sleep with him. There are a few options. Come on, everyone, that 80's enough reunion show is about to start. Well, Mary, have you seen Nicholas? Yeah, he's still upset because Abby threw out his baseball cards. Oh, well, maybe I should make him a sandwich. <laughs> oh, Dad, that's your solution to everything. <laughs> what? Eight is enough. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you know I love you girls. To Meg Griffin. <gasps> it's from Brown. <gasps> I've been Hey, that's great news! Let's clap it up, my high school girlfriend and I still say I love you in emails. I was hoping the good news and the clapping would offset this secret. But yay, Meg! Oh, isn't this place great? Amazing. Hi, my name is Isaac. I'll be your server. Have you all eaten with us before? I know, but I get how restaurants work. Now, what can I get for you, hon? Apartment 4G, like the iPhone. That's stupid, Lois. Don't ever say that again. Hey, how's everything going in there? Great! We're in apartment 4G, like the iPhone. Oh, that's so twisted. Did you make that up? Yes. What's all this? Oh, hey, guys. Uh, sadly, my Uncle Ray passed away last week, but he left me his vintage sports car. Joe, that's amazing that your uncle died. But I'm really sorry to hear about the car. You know what I think the problem is, Joey? I need to show them that I deserve to be Customer of the Week. You don't. I know, it's a silly little award, but I don't ask for much. You do. Well, they probably see a woman like me and think, yeah, she's got it all. They don't. I tip in cash. So? Now, I don't understand what I'm doing wrong. I feel like I really vibe with everyone there. You don't. And this is the one place, the one place that makes me feel happy. You aren't. Because I'm a nice person. You're not. And I can't think of one reason why they wouldn't pick me. I can. Yeah, I'm one of their best customers. You know, if I stopped showing up, They'd probably wonder where I went. They wouldn't. Oh, thanks for listening, Stewie. I had no choice. You know, I'm gonna show them that I deserve to win this award. Hey, guys, I brought a sneeze home from school. You wanna see it? Man. What? What's that? Every morning from 7 to 10, we serve a complimentary breakfast. Complimentary breakfast? Imagine the possibilities! Wow! Can I get you a cup of coffee? Coffee? Imagine the possibilities! Wow! It's time to swim in coffee! It's time to flutter kick.
The first thing I do is take down this wall to open up the kitchen. Just make this whole room a kitchen. And then I'm going to gut this bathroom, pull out all the toilets, and make it a kitchen. Same thing upstairs and in the master. So we won't have any toilets? Well, sinks are basically toilets. But it feels different. I can show you, and you'll see there's a very minimal difference. Uh, I just don't think I can go to the bathroom in a sink. That's what everyone says until they do it once. Now, let me walk you through my thoughts on the garage. You see where that car is parked? Imagine that all kitchen.